Become a new creature. Oh yeah. Born you, again. You gotta be born again. I am already born again. Born again. Born again. So what's your nationality? <laughs> you been to any church? I'm gonna go knock on one, kick one of them doors down on the church and, and, and insist that they feed you. Go one, go go holler at one of them poverty pimps. A pastor, they, they, they're poverty pimps. They got that. That's what uh, they are. The Lord ain't dealing with them pastors right. in these churches. He ain't dealing with them. They only looking out for their own What's best today? interest. On their own interest. Today's Martin Luther King's Day, Monday, the 21st. January 21st. Martin Luther King's Day. Moloch Day, right? Moloch Day. MLK. Yeah. So, uh. Hey, you, you know what? Can't gonna help me out. How? How much of food? Who, me? Yeah, I mean, I, can't, I ain't got no food. Seriously, if I had a sandwich, I'd give it to you. <laughs> we were just covering that with Lord said he's going to help the man and the yeah, yeah. and all that. He's going to feed him. But oh, I, I got something for you, though. I wish I can summon something. That brings a scripture to mind, though. Straight up, I wish I can summon something up. I'll hook you up with a meal. You know? Oh, here we go. Look, check I this got out. Some change, though, if you want some change. Yeah. I got one for you. It's better than nothing, bro. Tim yeah, Tim Hortons, go get you a sandwich. But first, you gotta listen to the scripture, though. Sandwich. Listen to this. Sandwich. sandwich. Check this out. Isaiah 55 and 1. Ho, everyone that thirsteth, come ye to the waters. Listen, listen. There, there goes there, 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 Listen now. You gotta listen. Ho, everyone that thirsteth, come ye to the waters. And he that hath no money, listen. Come ye buy and eat. Come buy wine and milk without money and without price wherefore do you spend money for that which is not bread and your labor for that which satisfieth not hearken diligently unto me and eat ye that which is good and let your soul delight itself in fatness listen incline your ear and come unto me here and your soul shall live and I will make an everlasting covenant with you. you know what the scripture said? The scripture said he's here, here, listen, you know? That's what he said. Oh, man, this is fire. That's what he's feeding you. Yep. You know, you can listen to this. He'll feed you another. If you're sincere in oh, listening to the, to, the, to the gospel, if you're sincere to listen to the gospel, he'll feed you. You know, but our people are stubborn and hard-headed. They ain't trying to hear the word. But they Our people want everything to be given to them. First of all, we're Israelites. Phone. We're Israelites. We're Video's peculiar people. Short. We're special people. And we're spoiled. So we like the Most High just giving us everything anyway because we are Israelites. It's in our spirit to want everything to just be given to us. That's our spirit, you know? Especially this new, uh, what they call it, this new entitled generation. They, and oh, they, everybody felt like they entitled to something. To, right, right, exactly. That's why they're on these, all these videos going up on the internet. These food stamps going to be cut off. These people talking about where, where my food at. We're going to feed my babies. Right, right. They think they're entitled to everything. New cars. Yeah. That's why these bitches quick to take their ass to court for this and that. I was about to give us a change. She walked away. Hey let, hey, let me finish this up. It said, incline your ear and come unto me. <laughs> incline your ear and come unto me. Here and your soul shall live. And I will make an ever everlasting covenant with you, even the sure mercies of David. Behold, I have given them a witness to the people, a leader, a commander to the people. Listen, this is that, what are you saying? Behold, thou shalt call a nation that thou knowest not, and nations that knew thee shall, that knew thee not, excuse me, shall run unto thee because of the Lord that God for the Holy One of Israel, for he has glorified thee. Seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Call ye upon him when he is there. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we, we out here found. This is the, to the Lord got, uh, he got workers. He got apostles, <laughs> disciples. That's right. We out That's here, right. you know, trying to, we making the Lord, we were publishing the gospel. That's right. You know, he's supposed to talk to us. 
We the ambassadors. We got the answer. Then Paul said he's an ambassador. Uh, yeah, ambassador. We yeah. ambassadors. Yeah. Yeah. So you supposed to listen to us. Don't nobody want to listen to us. <laughs> we crazy. You know, all y'all them crazy guys. Y'all them ones that be out there on that corner though. We ain't on the corner, we in the middle. This ain't no. <laughs> That's my baby's mom. You on a, you still on them corners. Fuck you, bitch. M Bass. B A S. A and B A S S S. I think I know how to spell it. Oh, that's M I think it. I think it actually starts with an A. But it, the words are related though. M Ambassador. M Ambassador. It's all the same word though. Actually, I bet it's related. When you do the etymology. There you go. Got a bunch of scriptures popped up. My fucking camera, man. I apologize for these short videos, bro. I don't know that cold weather, bro. I don't know. I'm messing with my battery. I'm about to buy a new battery or something. This is second print this five down. Cold gonna drain it in. Piss me off, man. Now you watch when it start getting warmer, the time will go up and up and up and up. That's weird. That's one thing I've noticed about my camera. Before. I thought if you put a battery in the freezer, it recharged. That's, that's how thing. that's the old hood shit. Right. Now then we are ambassadors for Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. As though the most high did beseech you by us, we pray ye in Yahweh Shai's steed, by ye reconcile to the most high. Ephesians 6 and 20, for which I am a new pastor in bonds, that therein I may speak boldly as I ought to speak. Well, speak boldly as I ought to speak. That battery's already gone. Get out of here, man. This is a nightmare. I got my my phone though. Go ahead, finish that up. Um Six and if Ephesians six and nineteen. As for me, that utterance may be given unto me that I may open my mouth boldly to make known the mysteries of the gospel, for which I am an ambassador in bonds. An ambassador in bonds. That's right. A lot of people are like, man, this feel like we in slavery. Like that. <laughs> but we you know right. but actually Paul was actually locked up though. Because Paul was in prison when he said that. And he was still doing the work when he was locked up. Oh, what's that one scripture that said that the truth has no bound? Uh, you can't, you cannot uh, bound the truth. You, can't, you can throw me in prison, but that truth, just me speaking it, it goes in your ears and it escapes the walls. You know, it goes, you could be in there cussing out the guards and you know, and they could get the truth. You know what I'm saying? Right. You can't imprison the truth. Well, well, you know, we were examples of that. Like when we got detained in uh, New York City, I went to work on these brothers, then we all followed in suit. <laughs> you know? Oh, Some yeah. brothers that was in there with us. <laughs> we was teaching that one dude to lock us up. Then we started teaching the cops. <laughs> yeah, we was teaching the cops. <laughs> For real. And man. he was talking about Israel, too. We weren't even worried about being locked. It's totally, I didn't care. Man. We actually did have fun. Totally. I didn't care no more, man. Yeah. You know, that's a blessing, though. That, that was an experience for me. That was you know? a beautiful experience. Right, 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 right. At least you, you've been through it. And, you know. I'm about to turn this off right quick. I'm going to come.